Hey, how's it going? It's Robin here. Thanks for joining me for your daily tarot card reading. This is for Thursday, December 29th, and I'm going to pull you guys a card from the Secret Language of Light Oracle card deck, and there's only a couple left, so it's not going to take me long to shuffle. <laughs> so this is for everyone. This is for the collective. I'm going to hang on to this card. Um, let's see what we have here. Channeling. Okay, this should be a really, really good card. Let me just find the book. Hold on. Okay, so I have the book. This is going to be a quick read, I think. It's not very much information, but I mean, to me, that's a good thing. Um, so before we go on with the channeling card, I just want to mention to you guys something that I've been um, reading a lot about lately is the Gateway Experience by Robert Monroe. And you guys might want to check it out. He also has a, a YouTube channel. So experience your stream of consciousness. This is your consciousness, not anybody else's. Um, and tapping into that is going to be really important for what you want to do next in your life. You have the ability to tune into different streams of consciousness to gain wise information for healing and expansion. Channeling shifts your awareness so you can stream information from various frequencies. It is just like tuning into a radio station. If the information doesn't agree with you, tune into something different. With practice, you will be able to tune into your soul transmission easily. You have a focused, you have focused a part of your stream of consciousness upon the earth plane to experience life in new and varied ways. Huh, they can say that again. Your soul loves you so very much. It is always transmitting this love and truth, even when you have forgotten. Okay, so um, inspired reflections and actions. Acknowledge how source sees you. Imagine seeing yourself through the eyes of your soul. Okay, open your heart, let love in and let source and your soul look, hold on, at the world through your uniqueness. When ideas pop into your head, write them down. Ponder whether this information makes your heart sing or shrink, okay? So this is where um, sort of the art of detachment can come in as well because this is the whole point of learning how to meditate is so that you can just observe thoughts without becoming emotionally attached to them. So if you're going to be channeling different information streams, it's best to learn how to practice the art of detachment before you start doing that otherwise you won't be able to change the cosmic channel and tune into different energies we can get really really sucked into negative energies very very quickly okay so this is where you also want to start learning how to protect yourself energetically um the first i found a, a playlist online on youtube from bob monroe and the first is it the first 40 minute series of one of 19 was talking about how to protect yourself so i think it's worth a listen to you guys and to really start to channel into different streams of consciousness so you can increase your awareness and knowledge so cool card i'll see you guys back here tomorrow bye